this one. Saying the National Television Awards are live on the telly tonight. Tonight, <coughs> excuse me, oh, yeah. Hello. Tonight, uh, the O2 in London, hosted as you say by Dermot O'Leary. Soap's going. Is she? Yeah. So I think the show's nominated, so she's going. It'll be a good night, I think. Well, I'll be watching at home, sitting yep. on the sofa, mm. aching. So John and Edward are performing. Yes, they are actually performing. And Dominic yesterday went to meet them. Yes, I did. Um, we watched the, their dancers uh, rehearsing backstage at a theatre. Just to give a scale of performance, who else is, is doing performance? Doing Lots of big names, Dave. And I'm glad you asked me. They don't normally have performers, though, well, do they? I'm thinking. I mean, are they just like some token joke that they're wheeling out? No, oh, I yes. don't... I, I don't... Th I, well, but no, possibly... Are they? Are they, are they a joke? Well, they've got to be a joke, yeah. haven't they? No! Lots of people love them. Lots and of people. Lots of young people like them. Uh, lots of people hate them, obviously, yeah. as well. They're a bit more. Mm -hmm. yeah. more hate them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really. Yeah. Um, Come on, then. Come on, I mean, see your nausea. The thing is, it is funny, mm. but it's kind of like the clock is ticking now, isn't it? Just before the interview starts, can I, or the clips, you know, that we'll play, can I just, you've got to tune into their voices because they don't speak like us humans do they speak really <laughs> really fast okay so you've got to really tune into that right so i've i've spoken to them about national tv awards they've done a bit of vanilla ice which we've heard from before so we can leave it there what i wanted to know was this is the first question before you know i realized what kind of people they are would they like to do an activity with the chris moyle show like we went go-karting the other week that? well because i hadn't i didn't know them that well at that stage um what activity would you like to do i thought that would be a decent place to start you need to concentrate yeah. Whatever the hell you want to guys do, just get us to do whoa, it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so, <laughs> now, I'll translate initially to help everyone along. It depends, uh, um, you, it's, whatever the hell you guys want us to do, we will do it. And then they go off and say, okay, okay so whatever you want, right. Whatever the hell you want to guys do, just get us to do it. Like something that's going to be in the World Book of Records. We should actually do a world record or something. We can't make it look as if we're having fun, because you genuinely have to be having fun. Right. Yeah. You know some people like make out they're having fun, they're like, yeah, 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 yeah. And it's like, no, I'm actually having any fun. That's right, okay, we need to do something that's like scuba diving or something and have like an underwater oh, camera. We, we have a scuba dive, international scuba diving license. I do. do you, is that called a paddy? No, it's or not a paddy one. It's a similar one. It was, um, it's a more official one. So scuba diving with the Chris Moyle show? Yeah, that'd be so cool. Yeah, wouldn't be cool. Swimming with sharks, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> they can go first. Right. Um, at this stage of the interview... How about, how about a, an activity called One Way Ticket to Timbuk 2? Yeah. Possibly. They go first. Possibly. At this stage of the interview, I was realising that it didn't really matter what I said, they would just talk. <laughs> mm. So I thought, let's just be as random as possible. Um, you can talk pretty much for Ireland, can't you, it seems. If I give you a subject, can you just talk to me about it? OK, broccoli. Um, broccoli, it's like this thing that you see on TV and all kids are like, oh my God, I don't like broccoli. But then it's kind of like you taste it, it's actually not that bad. And it kind of like really cool texture that you kind of like, it's like moss or I something. I think that those people are kind of like stereotyped, they're kind of like, oh my God, I, I like broccoli. I've always thought, uh -huh. uh, when I get my Sunday roast, I look down at the plate and go, is that moss on my yeah. plate? Or, <laughs> or is this this thing I've seen advertised on the television? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the broccoli? Hi, broccoli. What is broccoli? It's the thing that you see on TV that kids don't like. OK. Um, I thought that was school. Next up, strap yourselves in, olives. OK. I think it's kind of weird because, like, sometimes olives, like, I don't know, they taste a bit weird sometimes, and then, I don't know, I don't care, like, there's only olive oil, like, does olive oil come from them? I don't like all that oily food and stuff. Yeah, I don't like, I don't like olive oil. Yeah. It's kind of weird that all these olives are growing over in Italy and then they're transported all the way here and people are just eating olives and then people put little red things in them, like peppers. <laughs> Why do they do that? I don't know. <laughs> it's like a pepper. It's the type of person that when you kind of go, when you see them eating olives, you kind of go, oh, yeah, that person looks like someone who likes olives and then yeah. someone who doesn't like olives, you're like, yeah, they well, don't eat olives. It's the same like football teams. Like, you know somebody who supports Liverpool or somebody... It's me, I support Liverpool. You support Liverpool? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I kind of sense that. Yeah, thanks. Does one talk more than the other? Yeah, that's... <laughs> Sorry, even listening back, I'm stressed. That's John, who doesn't shut up. That was John, right? Edward wants to get word in Edgeways, but he can't because John talks. You sound, like a, you sound like an angry parent. Right, and here's another subject. I don't know. Carpets. I think that, like, carpets, you've never seen them in the elevator. Sometimes they're easy, like... They're like, you always have to keep hoovering them the whole time. It's kind of weird that you have, like, a cloth in the ground and people just wipe their feet in it and then you have to hoover it. And then some people have white carpets. What's the point in getting a white carpet? It's like just... 
paper yeah. on your ground. And it ends up just being and dirty. And then sometimes people have carpet on the walls and all the mites and everything that get into it. And then all that, then you, you're like hoovering it and then your hoover, the hoovering bags go out of date and then you can't get the hoover bags anymore. And then you get a new hoover. When you think about it, it's just a hoover and it costs yeah. so expensive. Okay, shush. <laughs> is it a joke? Okay, shush. <laughs> like, is it a joke? I love them. Do you know well, what? What were they like before and after? Genuinely, no. That right. is how they are. They just talk, but they wind each other up, so they get to the point where it's like manic towards the end. It doesn't matter what you ask them, they will just talk to you until you tell them... It's not endearing. ...to shush. No. No. I find Dave them, doesn't think so. I find them irritating, but yeah. funny. I, I, I don't get migraines, but I would imagine <laughs> that if I did, it would be a bit like that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, listen, it's, it's almost finished. Um, yeah. They are at the National Television Awards tonight performing, possibly with Vanilla Ice. Uh, but one other song they did on X Factor, of course, that they made famous. Ghostbusters. Was, yeah, when they jumped up and down a lot and shouted Ghostbusters. Well, they've done a version just for you. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. If something strange in the Christmas show, who are you going to call? <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, they do the drums. Yeah, they do. But when they do the drums, they look at each other and both go... Not well, their not heads. Their yeah, head. just so they're banging. Do they sit left and right, by the way, John and Edward? Yeah, they do. Do they? <laughs> Come on, you got to love them. It's something strange <laughs> in the Christmas show. <laughs> Who are you going to call? Well, obviously him at his show. <laughs> it's something weird. Wait, wait. And it don't look good. And Chris Moyles. Wait, wait. Is it something weird? Excluding and... Chris Moyles. <laughs> it's something weird. And it don't look good. Who are you going to call? Chris Miles. Chris A.K.A. Is. Ghostbuster. Brilliant. Um, it just it, doesn't make any sense. It's safe now. 